All right, what's up everybody? Today we're gonna be fixing our fence right here to uh, make sure that Odin doesn't keep escaping. And we're gonna have Vince to help us. Why don't you come over here, Vince? And say hello to everybody. Hi. All right, come, come closer, say hello. Hello. All right guys, so as you guys can see, the fence isn't very secured. Uh, Vince, why don't you try pushing on it to see what Odin used to do to escape. Just push on it, push on it a little harder. There you go, so that's all it really took. Got an idea, uh, it's gonna be fairly simple, I'm hoping. Uh, all we're gonna do is add an adjacent pole to this one in order to make sure that the latch is able to reach and fully secure and prevent it from opening. Uh, Vince, why don't you show us uh, the pole that we ended up buying from the Home Depot? Yeah, that one there. Hand that over here. So uh, we bought this pole right here from the Home Depot. It's about maybe 16 bucks and uh, we ended up getting a pole cap too in order to uh, prevent any water from going in there. They're just, it's going to go just like that and we're going to try to position it right next to it there. They're about the same height. Uh, Vince, why don't you come over here and show us uh, how we measure. Go get the measuring tape. There you go. So now uh, put it right next to the pole, Vince. Give him a little hand here. Okay, Vince, and uh, how tall is it? 40 inches. 40 inches, it looks like a little bit more. It's in between the 40 and the 40, 41, so. 40 and a half. 40 and a half inches, so that's the measurement that we ended up uh, cutting a pole right here to 40 and a half inches. That's the desired height that we were looking for. So I'm gonna show you guys the tools that we're gonna be using in order to make this more secure. Vince, hand me the drill so we can show everybody the drill that we're using. We're using this Milwaukee drill right here. It's an impact drill and I'm sure it's gonna get the job done. Uh, you could use a regular drill driver too. I'm sure it won't be a problem. Vince, hand me the screws. We're also gonna be using a pack of uh, hex head screws right here, some self-tapping screws. Uh, these are 5 eighths of an inch in length and like I said, they're self-tapping. And since they're hex head, we're gonna be using the attachment for it. This right here, which is a magnetic uh, attachment that attaches to our impact drill and uh, it's gonna help us fasten these self-tapping screws. And then the last thing that we're gonna be using are gonna be these brackets. Got these brackets right here too that we're gonna use to secure the two poles together. All right, so while checking to make sure that everything fits into place, uh, I noticed that the latch doesn't close properly. Pull right next to it and get on the other side. You can see the latch doesn't seem to be closing properly, so it looks like it's in the way. Uh, I'm gonna try to fix it by moving the latch up here and we'll see, hopefully that works. After readjusting our fence, uh, we had to use this tool right here, an adjustable wrench. Now it seems like we got it. Pull this right there and it latches on. So there we go. Now the next thing that we're gonna do, we're gonna install the brackets. One about right here, another one down here on each side, and uh, hopefully that uh, solves our dog escapee problem. So we marked the holes on the fence where we're gonna be installing our brackets. We're gonna attach it to this pole first because this one's you know stationary, it's not gonna move around. All right, let's get started uh, with the first bracket. We're gonna do the second bracket. Now we're gonna do the two brackets on this side. And the last one. See how it fits.
part, now that uh, our brackets are secured to the original existing pole, we're gonna attach them to the new pole. And that should be it. It looks like we are all done with the fence. Let's see how it works. Opens. Closes. It's pretty good. And uh, of course, we couldn't have done it without the help of Vince. Vince, why don't you come over here? This right here, my little helper. All right, bye everyone, till the next video.